welcome to another episode of DIY Try or Buy Fam. And if you haven't noticed already, I just want you to look at our fabulous set. <laughs> Can you guess what we're going to talk about today? Because this, this situation right here is something that me, he, and I both love, and that's the fall. <laughs> our favorite season. Favorite season, favorite season. So this episode, we're going to talk about why it's our favorite season, reminisce a little bit, you know, why it has become our favorite season. Um, maybe some resources that we can give people. We're here in the Midwest, so you guys already know the, the change of colors and things that we get to experience here. And we'll just talk about fall. Yes. All right, let's go. So, okay. Mihi, tell yeah. us about your experience with fall and why it's your favorite season. Uh, I love the fall. First of all, the weather. Uh, let's start there. Yes. We are so privileged to be in a climate where we do get all seasons, mm -hmm. but the fall is unlike... Some longer than others. Yeah. <laughs> fall is <laughs> unlike any other mm -hmm. here from the beauty of the changing leaves. Mm -hmm. Like, I love that we can just drive out just a little bit and we're... You can just drive along the highway and the landscape is just the prettiest colors you could ever see in the fall time. So I love that. I'm a person, I do love the change. Um, it looks pretty, but I also like the temperature. Mm -hmm. Me too. It's that like you wake up and the yes. grass is like dewy, maybe even a little frozen. Mm -hmm. But then as the day progresses, it gets warm and it's fun. Um, there's so many reasons. I got engaged um, in the fall. Aww. Yes. Um, <laughs> if you can't tell, I am a Notre Dame football fan, mm -hmm. married into this, and now I'm like all about it. <laughs> but thanks to my husband and his family, I got, uh, my husband proposed to me on Notre Dame's campus. I did not go to Notre Dame. He did not go to Notre Dame. But if you are, you live in Indiana and you're, you're from the Hoosier State, there's certain teams that you have affinities <laughs> to, um, and Notre Dame was one. So proposed to me on campus. It was the fall. It was beautiful. Um, for the football fans, it was the 2012 uh, season, uh, that, that year, the undefeated season. Thank you. So um, <laughs> it was the game. I, let me go real specific. We played Michigan, and we won. Thank I you. didn't know you played Michigan. Okay. We played Michigan, mm. and we won. Mm. Um, but, you know, that, mm. that was like the cherry <laughs> on the top. I was like, oh, I'm getting married. So, yes, proposed to me on campus. Obviously, Notre Dame has a special place in our heart. But in the fall, it's like, to me, the best time. There's football Saturday, and there's football Sunday <laughs> in my house. If you come to my house, we're busy on the weekends because we got games to watch. And... My TVs revolver revolved around sports. So wow, I didn't yes. know that. Me, we're, we're now I will say, although this is our favorite season, we're the complete opposite on why we love fall. Probably, like yeah. I like fall, big gatherings, tailgate, chili, mm, all of it. So, chili. what are your your reasons that you love fall so much? Sweater weather. Sweater weather. I love sweaters. I love boots. I love boots. I love the the weather as it speaks to the breeze, the leaves, and like y'all know I'm uh, menopausal right now, so <laughs> I appreciate a good breeze. And y'all know I have fans, so I love the breeze. I just the colors. Um, it's just beautiful. I got no. She got engaged in the fall. I got married in the fall. I used to own a bed and breakfast in Toledo, Ohio, and we got married at my bed and breakfast. But I still see. I love fall so much. I still love it. <laughs> We had a beautiful wedding. We had, I mean, it was just all pumpkins. We, we gave like, you know, again, I, I grow vegetables. So we gave away goodie baskets with all kinds of autumn vegetables. It was just like very local, very, it was dope. It was dope. He actually still loves the fact that we got married in the fall because we both love fall. Um, I love going to apple orchard. I love going pump mm -hmm. to pumpkin patches. I love hay rides. Now I'm not really a fan of the football, but I'm a fan of the tailgating because it's fun. <laughs> and there's food. <laughs> and it's food. And we be having a good time. We just kick it. Now, she hangs out more with South Bend folks. And y'all you know, know I love y'all too. But I've been, I have a lot of friends that went to Purdue. So, 
you know, I hang out with them and we have a good time. I love to cook. So my son and I love soup. So that, I mean, we eat soup all year round, but this is the time where I'm mm. really in there making a zupa. I'm making chili, chicken chili, whatever kind of soup, something brothy or hearty. Um, I love beans, you know, um, and then for some, it's the cuffing season. So <laughs> can you explain <laughs> what the cuffing season is? Because I didn't know, you know well, what here, that here's was. The thing. Here's the thing. It's, you know, they say, in the, and you can, guys can correct me on this. In the summertime, you get a boo, you have fun. But then when it starts to get, you know, cool and cold, this is the time where you prepare that person that you're with or you want to be with to be your boo for the for the cold season right so okay. that's the time when you netflix it and chilling that's what that is i don't have that. i'm just telling you what what they say okay <laughs> okay uh, but no i just love the, the the dress i mean you can just i mean it's just mm. the flyest the flyest time that you can just coordinate and just mix colors and i love burnt orange i love mm -hmm. like I love earthy tones, so I just love fall. Yeah, I'll show you some shoes. I love boots, I, so. I love it, because you're like fall fashion, right? <laughs> when you're, you're describing like my the hat, colors and oh, sweaters. I wear hats all day long. And my fall fashion is jeans and a hoodie. <laughs> that's my fall. Like, I, I can't wait. That's a part of my fashion, too. And I'll rock a boot with it, but definitely there... jeans and a sweater. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Capes, I love a cape. Love my hats, Gigi Pip, love fan of Gigi Pip. Yeah. yeah, I love it. Like the star color for me in the fall is the, I love wearing yellow anyway, mm -hmm. but I just love accenting my house mm -hmm. with yellow and oranges. We got to talk about decor. Let's talk about yeah. scents, the smell of fall. So like apple cider, pumpkin, pumpkin. spice. Are all you the, a, all now, the candles? <laughs> are you a pumpkin spice latte person? No, I don't okay. look for it. Neither am no, I. I, I know the I, phrase. I'm a, chai, I'm a chai latte. Okay. I'm not a pumpkin. Very timely in the fall too. Any chai latte, so. Is it true, I don't know, is it true that a lot of black people like pumpkin? We like sweet potato. Sweet potato, it's, we sweet potato people. <laughs> right? Okay, just me and Felix, I can't, we can't speak for all black people. But during Thanksgiving time, it, the, we don't do pumpkin pie. Sweet we, potato. We, it's sweet, sweet potato. potato all day long. So yeah, I mean, I like pumpkin, I'll drink it, but that's not what I gravitate towards, no. No, I will just do it. You know what? Time. I think future episode, we need to make a sweet potato pie with a Korean sweet potato. That would be dope. Because it was purple. Wasn't it purple? It, it's like a go more golden color, but they're very sweet. Mm. I like so, that. I think we need like to do Korean that. Like Korean people, they didn't realize that sweet potato was like a, a orange color. Like, like, what is that? Right. They're like, our sweet potatoes look different. Like, So I, I would love that. That would be huh. a great take. And interesting yeah there's a couple of recipes that we might have to try yeah we definitely gotta do that okay we're back to fall yeah so how do you dress up your home what is the decor because i'm not a big person so now that i get older and jackson my son he's a christmas baby so i go all out for christmas we have like five trees i do all kinds of stuff but i because i like fall i still do my thing so share with me what you do in your home i do like a tablescape um in the middle with pumpkins so i will get different sizes pumpkins oh i just i love it so it wreaths mm -hmm. with fall decor straw i'll put even like the little um people outside my house too <laughs> like just little scarecrow mm -hmm. like i love it the fall festival i think i have two like people that uh, like go on the other side of my fireplace in their fall one's holding a basket of apples like <laughs> To me, you cannot have enough fall decor. Okay. So, Clearly our decor is different, because I'm going to tell you I don't do that. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> candles, do. though. Candles, candles that smell really nice. Mm -hmm. the, the scents, too. The wax melting mm -hmm. scents. Uh, fall, fall scents I like to do. The so. cinnamon acorns, the ones you get yes. like at Michael's. I Anything. Love yeah. Cinnamon, the pumpkin, the warm, even like cinnamon vanilla. like. Mm -hmm. I love all it. of it. Yeah, all of it. For me, decor, I just do like pops around the house. Like I don't go all out. So I'll do like a pumpkin. Now I do. I love doing a, a good door. You got to have a good door. Nice doormat. Nice welcome. The those big welcome signs that they mm -hmm. have now that you can do. And then like a pump. This pumpkin. I don't do real pumpkins anymore because when you cut them and you put them out there, the squirrels eat them. Like mm -hmm. it's like you know food for them. So I just went. I go basic. I just get fake stuff. 
And if we do real pumpkins, it probably is just one, just to say one to the pumpkin patch now that Jackson's, you know, mm -hmm. I mean, he's older. But I'll do a reef, I'll do a door, I'll, I'll deck out my door. But then like around the house, I'll just put little pops of, you know, fall. But that's all I do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm also big, every year I get mums, like the yes. giant mums. Yes. Uh, we have a local place here I'll have to share with you. I'm in Cartersburg. But I, like these giant mums are like $6 each. Oh, you cannot you got, find that yeah, anywhere. I, mean, I didn't know. Okay, yeah, we got to go. We, we got $6, like six the big dollars ones? For That's one. cheaper than Costco. It, yes, exactly. I thought I was getting a deal. It's okay. not a secret, folks. Like I'll, you know, I'll share the link and, and where you can find it if if you're local to us um, in the county we we live in. But it's where I go oh every year. Gosh. Like my husband could not believe. He's like, "How much did you pay?" I'm like, six dollars. That's wow. why I got four. This is every year. Every year. Okay. And I'm I love like the colors. I love the purple, the deep red, the yellow. I get I get it all. Oh, I'm excited. A little extra definitely... because we have a big yard, so I want to get more color out mm. there it's nice to drive by you see my yard got so, months on it so are you into halloween do you do like go big in halloween or i'm not quite as big as halloween i have one little inflatable i put out like the window um but the fall and winter is tricky because you have two holidays really close and mm. i love christmas as well like mm. You said you have some trees, too. I know. Like, when, when you have multiple trees in your house, do you have a problem? I don't know. Never. You can never have enough Christmas. That's how I... And my son was born in December. So, like, I got to, I gotta, you know, carve out, like, oh, this is your birthday instead of, like, smashing it with Christmas. Mm -hmm. so, like, our Christmas, you know, I have to be mindful. But fall, mm -hmm. I think... To me, is more. I don't know. I love Christmas too. Wait till we do Christmas. I don't it's know just cozy. It's just. It is. It's just cozy. Fall is warm, mm -hmm. and you still get some really warm days. Yeah. In fall, mm -hmm. so sometimes yeah. you get those really surprise hot fall days still. So I, I like the weather shifts. In the so fall. so outside of football, is there a certain like orchard you go to, or certain activities that you do with your family that you could share with mm -hmm. people who don't live in the Midwest that might want to come? Yeah, so we are plentiful in the Midwest with our apple orchards, <laughs> our pumpkin patches, mm -hmm. like hay rides that you said. I grew up um, outside St. Louis. We had a place called Eckert's. Mm -hmm. We always, you know, we go to pick peaches, but in the fall there's pumpkins. You go pick out pumpkins too. And where we are, there we have a orchard called Beasley's. Beasley's. Yep. We go every year to pick out a pumpkin there. Um, so it's kind of yeah, a tradition to go out, pick out pumpkins, make mm -hmm. our son pick one out, mm -hmm. I pick one out. And Beasley's has like kind of like a general store, mm -hmm. and, you know, on their property. Um, and then I go for wood because I have a fire pit. So I get a ton of wood because if you go to the gas station and get wood, it's expensive. Mm -hmm. Like for maybe like what? Six six logs, it's like 20 bucks or something crazy. But if you go to Beasley's and you get like really good wood and I like to cook over an open fire, it's not it's not expensive at all. So I just load up my truck, go to Beasley's, get it, and then just put it on the side of the mm -hmm. house. So I like going there. So um, where do you, we love the decor items. So where do you go to get some of your fall decor? <sighs> Michael's, Target. Joanne Fabrics, um, Target. <laughs> uh, yeah, those are like, Michael's is like my, my jam. I love going to Michael's because I can make stuff. and But uh, yeah, I don't, yeah, I'll, I'm going to say those three. Fun fact, I used to work at Joanne. Really? Yes. So the girl, this girl can do some discounts on top of discounts. <laughs> um, like I got tips on when you should, you know, oh, you need which discounts are really the best. Um, like the buy one, get one. No, mm -hmm. no, don't, don't do that. But they, they'll have really, really good deals or on top of, um, like even sales or clearances. Like mm. I'm in there, I'm in there. I spend a little too much at Joanne. Like it's unhealthy. It is. Yeah. Like, that's why it's in, it's almost in season. Mm -hmm. Like, in the fall season, like, I have to make my run. But it's like in every other, like, Target run. Mm -hmm. Like, it'll be like triple the Target run. It's like Joanne Fabric and Michael's always has 60, 70% off. Like, never fails. Like, I know if I walk in there, I'm going to see something that's 60 or 70% off. And I love Joanne Fabrics is because those are where I can find the best things for my doorscapes. Other than that, yeah, I, I love Joanne. Love I know, it. I know. So because I used to work there, 
I just, you know, there's too much that I know. And I'm like, <laughs> okay, they're about to release this. Okay, this Sunday, just wait. They're going to extend the sale one day, you know, like all those things. So I just, I love Joanne. It brings me a time. I actually worked there right um, right before I got married. I wanted some discounts. I'm going to let the people know. So I worked for Joanne because I was, I did a lot of DIY for my wedding mm-hmm. um, and just like with the flowers. And so you got really great discounts as an employee at Joanne, just, just so you know. And a lot of teachers, you know, work second jobs and I was a teacher at the time and I did but I thoroughly enjoyed working in the retail space but that's where my love of like fall decor like I I see some things that rotate I'm like I know next year I can get this if I forgot you know I didn't Mm -hmm. get it the year before so yes Joanne is my guilty pleasure for all my fall decor so I am looking forward to uh, just recently I went to uh, Bloomington Indiana I had a quick getaway and it was absolutely gorgeous. It is out in the boon docks. It is like very remote, but the, the trees, everything is absolutely gorgeous. I'm, sa- I'm sharing this with you because I'm going to go back in the fall because I know it's going to be gorgeous. The, tree, the trees are gonna change the leaves, I mean. And um, we, it's a getaway spot where you go and there's horse trailers. So there's a trail and everybody has a trailer, their own fire pit, their own. I mean, it was so, it's so dope. And I don't camp, I glamp. (laughs) So everything in that horse trailer was high end, really gorgeous shower and bathroom. We wasn't out in no outhouse, nothing crazy or yeah. So we had electric stove. So we did like an overnight trip and had a ball. So I'm going to take Jackson and my family there for the fall for a getaway. Mm-hmm. So I'm looking forward to that. What a great like fall boots. break. <laughs> yeah, fall break trips because, you know, kids have fall breaks like a week typically mm-hmm. or a few days. What a great like quick getaway locally mm-hmm. too. And fall is peaceful too because like when you have the, the, the beautiful leaves and you like if you go like to Hawking Hills, you go somewhere in Michigan because I'm from Michigan, like the trails – and then the water, the brooks, it's just so pretty. The best pictures are taken. You know, most people take their like wedding pictures in the fall because that's mm-hmm. just, it's just pretty, mm-hmm. right? Yep. Mm-hmm. So east and west coast, you might have the ocean, <laughs> but you don't have our leaves changing. <laughs> They're like, y'all can have y'all leaves. Yeah, I know, right? But it is. If you can <laughs> get to somewhere in the Midwest, if you don't live in the Midwest mm-hmm. and, you know, partake, maybe in football Mm -hmm. and, you know, a day to just like drive, you know, Mm -hmm. I think sometimes just driving through and seeing it is just as beautiful too. But if you're able to stop, you know, we have beautiful places not too far from us in Brown County, just Mm -hmm. known to have like wonderful hills and uh, it's the best in the fall. So, Mm -hmm. and I can't, I can't show you my shoes, but cause you know, the cameras, but I'm going to show you, I love sweaters and my boots in the fall. So I'm going to show you my Uggs. I've had these for years. But they are so comfortable, and I feel like I'm like walking on, like clouds, because this is how comfortable they are. Maybe like six years I've had these shoes, and then I love these shoes. They are so fun. This is Angela. This is Angela. Yeah, this is Angela's shoe. Wonderful. I just love boots. Like mm-hmm. I love a heel. I love like a, a hiking boot, boots and sweaters all day long for me. So, yeah. I'll just share two. I just had a, a, like some shoes on the side, but yes, sweater weather and boots for me. Yeah, football, <laughs> football and the colors for me really mm-hmm. is what mm-hmm. I love fall. So yeah, what do you do for fall? Definitely <laughs> right. share any great spots that you do. Do you travel to mm-hmm. a location? Um, oh, and if there are restaurants that have seasonal menus, mm-hmm. let us know what restaurant that we need to visit. Don't, isn't Devour Indy in the fall? They have mm-hmm. been in the fall. So, yeah, if you guys know of a restaurant that we need to visit in the fall that has great whatever, let us know. So, yeah. And, you know, and then, you know, professional football NFL starts, too, <laughs> at the same the time, football. right? <laughs> Saturday, Sunday is like, I'm telling you, the weekend's a wash for us. Like, we are watching games. So, we love a going live because there's nothing like in a tailgate experience yes. with, with nice you know, people rock. that are. I also think that mm. sports I'm hungry. bring people together. Yes. Right, you're cheering for the same team. You 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 can be very different from one another, but you are aligned for your team, no matter what team you cheer for. I mean, there's some teams that are better than others. 
Pray for us and the Indianapolis Colts. Pray for us. I think maybe we have a few picks. Felix is shaking his head. He's like, that's not my team. Um, But there are some great teams, so I'm excited to get my chili on. My brat. brat. Right? Like, we we do a thing. We actually have um, family members that we live in the Indy area. We rotate... We rotate um, hosting um, like little parties Mm -hmm. to watch Notre Dame games and we switch houses Mm. during the season and that's just really fun and the kids are around so it's kind of what we do is like a tradition I can't wait to start that back up. Do you do like flavored beers around this time around fall time? Um, I will try them, or like cider, the Oktoberfest, yeah, the ciders mm-hmm. come in, like, some people love that. I have a friend who loves her some Oktoberfest, <laughs> right, and, and the specific, you know, um, brand, but I, I'm not a huge beer drinker, but I will drink beer, right, I'm not, a, I'm not opposed to any wonderful libations, how about that, I don't, you know, but I'll try it. Okay. So. All right. Well, I think that's we've covered everything that we love about fall. Yeah. Hopefully you love fall just as much as we do. Yeah. And absolutely. feel free to suggest uh, places for us to check out and make sure you like, share, subscribe to the podcast you didn't know you needed. Happy fall.